quitting smoking may be good for you, but it comes with a health warning for these tobacco farmers in southern France. Reforms to Europe's common agricultural policy mean that this industry has just lost millions of euros worth of subsidies. With fewer incentives to grow tobacco and fewer people smoking it, these growers in the Dordogne have now formed a collective to share materials and labour in a desperate drive to recoup costs. Our European subsidies have been taken away, so we'll be down an euro per kilo. It's just not viable anymore. There's no profit margin left to produce tobacco. The first response was a hefty price hike on the raw leaves, but many say without outside help, they simply won't bother replanting next year. To be honest, it's not just the machinery here which will be in doubt. It's all production, full stop. There are some 2,500 tobacco growers in France, but the industry is thought to support around 10,000 people in all. At this factory, a staff of well over 100 prepares the leaves which will be rolled into cigarettes. We're directly affected. I mean, if tobacco production disappears tomorrow, then we'll disappear with them. All eyes now are on the government. Compensating the growers for lost EU subsidies would cost around 15 million euros, working out at around 5 cents per pack of cigarettes. Not unreasonable, they say, given that the last tax increase on smoking of 6% raised 700 million euros for the state.